Oh, oh, that's a PMC. Ooh. All right, this is not a good spot, actually. I think we got a team. Oh, he's dead. I got no bandage. What are we at? About half. It's just a light bleed. This is a team, I think. Oh. <laughs> Please have meds. Oh, isn't it? Oh, it's a bird. I might die looting, but dude, give me something. <laughs> this is not good, boys. My God, they don't have anything. There's really nothing I can do but just try to run out. Whoa, whoa. Scav? Friendly? <laughs> what is going on guys? Welcome back. Back in some SPT today. Uh, I made a little bit of changes to the mod list. I removed the GTFO mod which is what showed me kind of on screen the uh, extracts and task locations. And instead, I got dynamic maps and a game panel HUD. And we're going to see. <laughs> we're going to see what that's like right now. And it looks like it's working. As you can see at the bottom of my screen, I got a compass. So it shows extracts, the distance to them, the name of them when you look at them. Wait, that's actually really nice. What the hell? Um, I just did a scav ray just to see. I left on. There's a lot of HUD elements I didn't really want. A whole bunch of HUD elements, so I removed most of them. So currently, I just have the compass. That sounds like a juicy gun. Um, and I got the uh, in the bottom right. You'll see my weapon information, uh, fire mode, ammo, ammo in the tube, ammo in the chamber. So that's kind of nice. I, I don't know if I'll leave all that on. We'll see. I just wanted to kind of play with it. And we also have this. This is actually sick. So there's a map. You can just hold him. You can look at the map. It shows you can see where I'm at. We got uh, all kinds of doors, locked areas, uh, as well as extract locations. And you can see that the extracts, like the one right behind me here, is red because I need a key to uh, to use it. I need the factory key, and the, and the mod recognizes that. So that's pretty sick. That's an enemy. Okay. Oh, and he just blacked. Okay, I may not live this one, but we'll see. Do I even have meds? Of course not. I got salt. That's not gonna do me too good. Yo, this guy... Where's he going? Do you just go up top? Oh! Wait. What just popped up on screen? 175? Is that my... Hold oh, on, I think there might be an XP notifier turned on. That's cool. <laughs> oh, jeez! Yeah, 175 XP. Okay, so we actually had a, uh, we have an XP. That's kind of cool, but I don't think I want that on, personally. There's, I'm just having so much fun with, with SPT, guys. Oh my gosh. I, it's really cool. Especially when, and there's so many mods. These mods that I just added, I got from the comments of the last video. So thank you to those of you that recommended them. Um, I am going to go ahead and turn on my FPS and... Let me just take a look here and I'll also go through some of the some of you guys requested to see like what my settings were for uh, for the donuts. I think mod I left everything basically default. The only thing that I changed was the preset. The uh, the only thing I changed is this. It's starting PMCs only and more scavs. I'm sure there are some things that could be more beneficial if I set them up a little differently, but I'll let those of you that have done done tweaked all these and messed with them to uh, to let me know in the comments. Uh, I'd be I'd be happy to change it, but I think it's OK right now. And then this game panel is the one that you just saw a little bit of. So we got weapon HUD, you have kill HUD, which is, I think this is what is giving us. Yeah, okay, XP HUD display. I think I'm gonna turn that off, but it's pretty cool if it is on. If you turn on kill HUD display, it'll let you know, like you get a kill, it'll tell you the distance, it'll tell you the XP, it'll feel like Battlefield 4, basically, <laughs> which is pretty cool. Uh, but I'm gonna turn off basically all those. I really like the maps, look at this. You can actually hover over them if you go to the actual map tab. So I can see this is old gas. This is ZB13, ZB12, ZB11. You got all your dorm rooms, 
locked and not locked scab extracts pmc extracts there's our factory ground zero i will be probably using this one a little bit today oh my you can zoom in i'm surprised this isn't more cluttered for interchange being as big as it is yeah i mean it's a fully like interactive map this is something that you would think would just be in the game honestly Nikita said no. All right, let's uh, let's see. I'm thinking I, I kind of want to bring in an MP5. I'm not worried about the helmet. Get some glasses and some stuff. There we go. Looking looking pretty good. There we go. Um, all right, let's do it. Ground zero. Who's who's this guy? <laughs> I don't know. You know your stuff. Let's raid some. Is this one of you? I don't know. <laughs> and we're in. Oh yeah. Um. Ooh. This is very vibrant. Oh my god. Just got a flash drive. I don't think, and I could be wrong, but I don't think any of these spawns, like loot spawns, are different in uh, SPT. At least not, like, by default. Oh wow, it even, like, highlights the... That's crazy. Let's, uh, let's head over to Emercom first, because I think we're, like, fairly close to that. If I can find a way out of here. One thing that's really fun <laughs> about the uh the ai is the new like pathing they have jesus christ what they will uh they'll sort of be anywhere including like sniper scavs i think like they they oh jeez. speaking of i hope that's not a sniper scab am i like stuck in here okay well we gotta move oh Ooh. okay i hope we can get out this way all right, we may have to just find a way to kill this guy. I don't know how we'll do it. So we have an MP5. We need to go like out the door and to the left. Maybe I can just hop out. Yeah, that's this. I'm moving. Okay, we we got out of that situation. Okay, we are at Emercom. Could be some guys here. I don't know if that's a static body. I don't think so. Hey, there we go. When you find a body, you don't know who killed him. Do you loot the body? Yeah. <laughs> it's a player. Okay. Juice. I need that. We got some missions over here. Saving the mole. Locate the scientist. Locate PMC group. So we can kind of loop around and head towards these. I like this compass like way more than the, uh, the GTFO. GTFO was a good mod. Definitely works. Serves the purpose. But this just feels a little more streamlined. And I'll, uh, I'll keep the mods that I'm using, like, up to date in the descriptions. Or at least I'll, I'll do my best to. And, uh, because I imagine they're going to sort of be changing throughout the, uh, the playthrough until I really find the, the perfect mix. And what's really cool about SPT is, I mean, you can go the complete opposite direction with the, with, with the whole game. You can make everything easier if you really, like, wanted to. You could genuinely, and I might do it for a video, just, cause, just to see how far you could take it. I think you could pretty much turn this game into, like, an arcade shooter. Oh, shit. What was that? Was that just debris? From, like, a grenade? I didn't hear a grenade. I feel like I just got shot at. I don't like that. I'm gonna run. Yeah, I don't know. Let's check these, uh, weapon boxes. TOZ. Oh, wait, do I need this? Yeah, I do. Um, we'll actually take that for the task. Is this too vibrant? Somebody tell me. I feel like it's a little bit... A little bit too vibrant, but I don't know. Sometimes it looks different on YouTube than it does for me. Oh. Oh, he's aggressive. Nope, he ran. Hold on, let's, uh... Is that him? Yep. Look at him slow peeking. What the... What a psycho. He was actually slow peeking. He was doing this whole number. Okay, I'm having a bit of trouble taking him down. Got him. Headshot. Last bullet. Love to see it. <laughs> I like that. I really like that. Gotta find the scientist. Here he is. He got owned. I wonder what he has. A key. Science lab. 
Oh, required in the quest. Okay, so we actually do need that. Nice. Okay, what's next? Uh, oh wow, do you see it on the map? There's a, uh, a body indicator. So whenever I get a kill, it marks the body on the map. <laughs> that is pretty sick. I actually dig it. Uh oh, am I still in single? Oh my goodness. Oh my god, this guy's been looting. He's got a full bag. Oh, he has a car battery. Dude, I need that. We are running out of room quickly. Okay, let's check this other guy. Here's what I'm thinking. We're gonna take his MP5. <laughs> Nice. His MP5 is a little nicer than mine, I think. Yeah, it's got a sight on it. Whoa. There might be somebody after me. How? Who killed all these people? Okay, we made it to the office. Now we need to find a hard drive. It's right there. All right. There's definitely some, uh, some scavs outside. I've been hearing them faintly. This guy got killed by somebody that was watching the door. You guys hear that? There's literally somebody breathing. Is that a glitch sound? That's terrifying. What the heck? Bro, I can hear- I hear somebody breathing. I don't like this. It's gotta be a bug. No, it's just a fucking rat. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Hello. Um. Alright, this guy's a little bit tanky. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh man, okay. Alright, we gotta bandage up. Um, please bandage. Why are you not bandaging? Why is he not bandaging? What? Is it a heavy bleed? Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Yo! <coughs> I think they're looking for me. Oh, I have three heavy bleeds. Of course I do. My goodness, that guy destroyed me. I might not make it out of this one, actually. Okay, let's fix that stomach first, because we're going to lose a whole lot of energy and hydration. On this uh, HUD mod that I added, there's actually a, uh, you can get your full health, stats, energy, hydration, everything, all up on the, uh, bottom of your screen, which is pretty cool. Okay, I think we're good. This guy was looting. Did I hear something? I really want to search this, but this is where the greed really gets you killed. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing it. There's a vehicle exit right in front of me. I do have exactly 5,000. Don't know if it's been... Uh-oh. The vehicle exit is up. Can I get to it? Eek. All right, I called it. Oh my god. I don't know if I can hold out. Oh! Where are they at? We have two more tasks to do here, but I am not feeling optimistic about it. Oh, I got one? Yeah, we're out of here. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. That was a good one. Not a bad raid. All right, let's look at tasks. I definitely think we got some things to turn in. A therapist, job done. Nice shortage. Uh, not the Salus. Uh, supplier, 
Hand in the TOZ, we already did that. Oh, we need the 3M body armor. Turn in the hard drive. That job's done. Gunsmith part one, classic. Introduction, go get Jaeger from Woods. Artem gives you tactical clothing? Say what, are these all like custom? I didn't even know this. I added this, uh, this Artem guy just to have another trader just to see what that would be all about. I didn't realize he gives you a whole bunch of, whole bunch of clothing options. All right, now let's see how much money we just pulled. We're gonna sell some of this stuff. 150 grand, about 200 grand if I add in those suppressors. I think it's time for some woods. All right, I'll roll in with this. Try to maybe find some Salus, some 3M body armor, and we'll go get the, uh, the message, the letter on woods. Man, it's so nice to have a map. That's like so nice. Um, yeah, we'll probably just loop around, get the letter, head to, uh, the outskirts exit and uh should all be pretty nice should be a breezy day in the woods i don't know this could be kind of weird this will be a good test to see how uh how cheesy the ai's distance is and accuracy i haven't noticed any weirdness to it yet to be honest but it does seem like they will spot you from a pretty good ways away if you're especially if you're just kind of standing there looking at them man if you can if you can let go of the, the possibilities in multiplayer i really truly believe Single player Tarkov is a it's kind of a better it's kind of a better game. <laughs> feels like it. <laughs> Obviously, that's my opinion, but you know, this feels nice. Feels nice to play. Oh my! Is that got some movement right over here? Did he just go down into the bunker? I swear I just saw a guy. Oh yeah, yeah. He saw me. That might be a scav. Uh, Got him. Uh, See, am I dropping mags? I am. I didn't bring extra ammo. Oh, I did it again. Dude, I gotta quit doing that. That was a PMC. Hey, yo. I think I killed him. Okay. <laughs> we're having a bit of a... We're having a bit of a bleed. They may have been on a... On a team. Or wait, was that... That was the same guy. I don't think I ever killed him the first time. Oof. Just about blacked out both my limbs. That would have really sucked. See what this guy oh my goodness that's what i wanted and he has the armor <laughs> and he's got some water for us it's good oh he's got magazines for that okay hold on yeah he's got bp yo all right take his ears honestly we'll take his wait no i want my helmet okay holy moly oh he's got a flashlight let's reload this thing this is a nice sks this is what makes the mod so fun to me, is because you could find shit like this. Just like really sick modified guns. Yup. That might be a screenshot, boys. Okay. Back on task. We are good on food and water. Everything's looking fine. This is a perfect gun for woods, honestly. A little more zoom would be nice, but... It's, uh... Mm. Actually, the, the ergonomics on this are pretty terrible. It takes a long time to aim. This right here, this plane crash, if you sort of follow the wreckage a bit, keep an eye out on the sides in this little ditch that it created, you can find some decent items sometimes spawning. Sometimes you'll find, I found like some pretty good meds before. The game might make me a liar right now. Oh wait. Ah. Uh ah. -huh. Uh. No. Where's he at? There's a Salua there. I really want it. I'll get you shot in the back. This is not a good situation to be in. No way, I just killed him through a tree. 
I hope this guy doesn't push me. Damn. Arm and leg blacked. Ah, fuck it. I'm gonna go for the heal. See if he pushes me. Whoa. What is that? What? <laughs> Somebody was looting my body! <laughs> that was my kill, bud. He was wigging out on it. I saw the guns moving to his back. Okay. We're in a bit of a pickle, though. There's a guy over here on the other side of the plane, still. And he is not showing himself. It is possible that he ran. I mean, that is a thing. I think my best option is to grab this Salua. And then head uphill. Might as well go and fix our arm. Do we need to have the Salua at 100% in order to turn it in? I don't think so. Pretty sure I'm going to use it. Alright, both those bodies are looted. I think I might attempt doing a bit of flanking. Hold up. I saw the top of his head. Then he fucking disappeared. Whew. This was the guy I saw, okay. I was looking for that helmet. That rig would be nice, but I don't think we have the armor to replace ours with. Let's go ahead and grab this letter. A little contact info. And, uh, now we can start making our way out of here. Uh, hopefully Sniper Scab is not up there. He might be. Oh, shit. Okay, Sniper Scab is up. Damn. I just whiffed so hard. Is that a flashlight? What the fuck was that? Oh. Jeez. Oh shit, there's another one. Oh, is that a shotgun? My god, I cannot. <laughs> oh, I'm getting shot at by somebody else, too. That sniper scav? I think I'm running out of ammo. I'm gonna sit tight for a second. Uh oh. Got him. Holy shit. Please die. Ow. This guy's messed up. My gosh. Get me out of this place. My leg is broken, of course. You rats! Leave me alone! He looted the body earlier. Yeah. This is the same rig from before. This guy went and looted that body from the guy we killed near the plane. Um, we got two more bodies to check and then, uh... Really, seriously, actually, gonna get just get, we gotta just beeline it out of here. Three more, three more bodies. I was wrong. They don't really. They just didn't stop coming. 
You know what? I think just for the sake of being able to loot, I'm dropping this armor, wearing the module armor, and then I'm going to take most of this stuff in my bag. Shit. Got somebody close. <laughs> Boys, I'm running out of time. I gotta go. We got quite a ways to go. I think we can get there in eight minutes, but that's if all goes fairly well. Oh, jeez. No. Who are you? My brother, leave me alone. <laughs> of course there's just a guy there. There most definitely is. Some more enemies lurking around. There's a guy right there. Two guys. Hopefully they're just scavs. And hopefully they didn't just spot me. Oh no. Really gotta be all eyes and ears in this game, man. Even in SPT, it is not much different. <laughs> I usually, you know, a lot of y'all come from my stalker videos, and I, I sort of feel like I talk a lot during those. I'm a bit more quiet in situations like this. I'm sure you can understand why. <laughs> it's gonna be sick if I get out of here, I, I will say. I really want this SKS. Oh, I forgot you can do this. If you hold R, you can scroll wheel and heal exactly what you want to heal. Oh, shit. I need another Vaseline. Oh, there goes my energy. It's just gone like that. So my stamina, therefore, is gone. Didn't think about that. Now I'm losing a lot of health. I hope exit campers aren't a thing in SPT. Surely not. <laughs> <laughs> we fucking made it. A minute and a half left, just about. 7,000 XP. Yo. <laughs> Look at all these kills. Oh, I, I killed Sniper Scav. I guess he bled out, I, I imagine. I'm not really 100% sure. 68 hits, 150 <laughs> shots fired. That's not bad. Almost 3,000 damage Delta Body. I love the stats breakdown at the end of these. We got the SKS. Hell yeah, that's what I wanted. That thing is juicy. I definitely want to try to get a grip on it or something. Maybe a different stock. These ergonomics are bad, dude. It's nine. <laughs> Let's go to tasks. Turn in what we did. Eliminated the scavs for a side mission. That was just for... Yeah, it gives us a little bit of junk. It's all right. We can turn in that Salua that we used half of. Um, Wait. Hand over the found in raid. BNTI module three and body armor. BNTI module 3 and bottom. Is it need to be repaired? Is that what's going on? I hope it's not too broken. That would be really unfortunate. Why can't I hand it in? Oh no! All that? I did all that for the armor and I can't turn it in. It's not that broken. Oh man. I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something. We did get the letter though. Now we can get Jaeger. Acquaintance mission accept. We can give him the noodles, which we just picked up. That's amazing. We need some uh, the lunch boxes and some beef stew. All right, let's sell our valuables here. Made a solid 85,000. Not bad. We are at 1 million. Let's go. We broke 1 mil. Uh, 10 more grand. We can get a lucky scav junk box. We'll need one fairly soon, I think. All right, well, this was another couple of pretty good raids, if I say myself, uh, on some SPT. I'm really enjoying it, man. It's so good. As always, like the video. Leave comments. Let me know what you think, what you want to see. I'm always happy to hear from y'all. Big shout out to the Patreon. Thank you guys all for the support. It means so much to me. By the way, if you haven't seen, Stalker 2 dropped another trailer. And, uh, man, <laughs> it's looking good. It's looking real good. Stay tuned if you want to see some more of this or, uh, you know, some Stalker content. All that good stuff. Thanks again for watching. I will catch you all in the next video. Peace out.